of uh, yes. zombies. This one's a rusher, though, so basically he runs up, and I think he can... I think he like jumps on you like a hunter does from All Left 4 Dead too, but I'm I, or from Left 4 Dead rather, but I can't honestly remember if he does or doesn't. But yeah, he's a more advanced zombie. Like I said, there is a couple different types of zombies as we play. I don't know if you've guys noticed or not. There's roamers and then there's a uh, something else too. Stalkers. That's what they are. Done. Consider it done. Consider it done. Let's turn around and get rid of the stalkers first. I don't think the roamers are going to move. Could be wrong, though. On it. Let's have you take point. Consider it done. Consider it done. On it. If it's not too... Too crazy up there. Roger. Move Q's and Q up. Almost level three. Pretty much should be level three. I mean, what is that? See what else we find. I haven't really found anything anything good. Getting some shitty luck. We're almost at the pub though. Didn't take me nearly as long as I thought it would to run all of all over the place and get all those loot chests. Chestuses. I don't even have a breach in charge, so I couldn't breach that if I wanted to. So now I can get shotgun, specialization, luck, or boost critical. All squad members have a 5% higher chance of critical hits. Probably going to go for that. Luck or sidearm proficiency. Let's go for sidearm. Probably combat neck. So, here's our first encounter with actual human enemies. Uh huh. Consider it done. Uh huh. Roger. You got it. And this is more of a breach and clear element, anyways. Nice close knit uh, building. Keep Ninja there in case they try to funnel out. Ready on your go. I think it's just one guy left. Two guys. I have that great of a consider it done. Shot on him. Got it. Let's go like that. Apparently Ninja still can't see him. Can nobody see him? Ready on your go. Apparently not. Uh-huh. 
There we go. The other two should have leveled up from that. Area's clear. Nice, they did. Let's go ahead and give them their skill points now. Let's go for health, I guess. Definitely LMG specialization. Specialization. I'm saying special. Come grab what we're here for. Which is that. Ammo will definitely take, of course. Might as well run the uh, alcohol back over. Now you gotta be careful, because uh, another thing that happens is that right there. You'll have uh, the zombies randomly spawn up in places you're already cleared. It's a good thing he's not really moving that much. You do get experience from this if it's not an actual, like, legit operation. If it's just kind of like something you stumble upon, you get experience for it. You can also get scrap and stuff too, obviously. Oh god, thank you. Look, give these to our nurse over there. Come back to me after. First thing I want to do... I'm gonna put the sniper in there just in case I decide I want it. And I'm gonna put all these triggers in there too. You do have a limited space in your inventory, but I think it's like, oh, there it is right there, never mind. The MK I'm gonna break down. I'll show you guys that. There, scrap, confirm. If you upgrade it, basically the weapon level goes up some, and then you'll see certain things go along. If it has attachments, then you can, uh, I don't know why an Xbox button comes up when you press that. If you have attachments, you can choose to put them on. Obviously, you can't put, like, two triggers on one, but you can put, like, a trigger in ACOG and uh, a foregrip. That would be a thing you could do. Stuff like that. You can rename weapons, too, obviously, so instead of M4, it could be, like, hand cannon. Although that doesn't make any sense because it's, I mean, it's still in your hand, right? But I'll name it Justice instead. Justice and War. If you guys are in the squad and you want a weapon or a name for your weapon, let me know. All right, so we'll talk to the nurse, so back to Elizabeth, and then we'll be on our way. Wow, didn't think we'd get these. Thanks, whoever you are. Look, we could always use more medical-related supplies. Just look around at these people. The more you can do to help, the better we'll be. Sure, but you are? Oh yeah, sorry, I'm Tyler. Got with this group about six weeks ago, and they were in bad shape. Decent lodgings, and only a few raids a week, so it's not too bad. I used to be a nurse downtown. Figured I'd help in exchange for some security. I'll tend to these supplies. Thanks, by the way. We could really use some me uh, real medical supplies, though. There's a drugstore down the way. Medical equipment, food, whatever you can carry, then maybe we can help you in return. Sorry about the gate. That thing's a real pain in my ass. But the problem, or the real problem, is the generator. Needs coolant and fuel. I think I know where this is going. Yeah, the Petrol Plus station on Beach uh, hasn't been totally stripped clean yet. I'll mark it on your map. I can't imagine what a Special Forces squad has been doing in the middle of the this for six months, and when you suddenly show up on our doorstep. But if Liz trusts you, then we'll have to do. Look, we've got a situation we could use assistance with. One of our supply runners just radioed in a distress call. He's trapped in the far side of the stadium parking lot across the street to the south. Seems all the activity around here lately has all or attracted some unwanted attention from the infected. Supply runners? Yeah, members of our group that are capable of locating and retrieving essential supplies like food and fresh water from the abandoned shops and homes throughout the city. It's dangerous work. 
The ones that trapped, uh, the one that's trapped is one of our best. If he's radioing for help, he must be desperate. If you're going to help us, you should get going. Okie dokie. If you try to talk to her, she'll just be like, well, what are you waiting for? Get going. So basically, she knew he was going to send you us, send us on a mission. We are going to go quests. I'm going to make this one the active quest because it's actually closer. And then by the time we finish that, it'll probably be time to go. The petrol one is going to be probably the hardest quest we'll ever, we'll ever do, period. It's so hard to break into the petrol, like, into that uh, gas station. And I don't know if it's the level gap or if it's just because of the positions they hold. But it, you'll see what I mean as soon as we get there. Got it. Got it. Yes, sir. Uh-huh. It's not to say that they might not pop up from behind me, but... Roger. Tell you the truth, they're coming from the right anyways, or the left. <laughs> you two need to turn and face that Ready way. Ready on your go. If you don't, we're gonna die. This is gonna be hard enough as it is. He should just switch back to his weapons. Use an actual assault rifle for now. Ready on your go. You got it. Consider it done. Fortunately, I don't really have any, uh,. Jeez. Any good uh, skills that would help in this situation? It's another hunter. Or hunter rusher. You want to call them hunters. Another one down there. I think we'll be okay. Worst comes to worst, I have medical kits and stuff. But I probably won't need it for now. I'm gonna need it for later, if anything. Roger. You'll definitely see why later. Consider it done. Kind of in a shitty spot to hold out, but there really isn't any good spots on this one. From what I remember. On it. Consider it done. Consider it done. See how like confused they got for a second there? They're like, oh, they went on the other side of the barricade? What do? So this is why I didn't want to have two assault rifles in the same squad. I'm already out half the ammo. All clear. Look, look how much ammo I used. Good work. All clear. But I would have needed it for there, so. Yes, sir. Stay sharp. All right, let's talk to this guy. Thanks for the assist. I was getting a little hairy, or it was getting a little hairy out here. Lena said over the radio that she was trying to send help. I can make it back from here. Now, before I go on to this next mission, I want to go back. Not fully, well, yeah, I do want to go back so they can heal, but there's another reason I want to go back. I 
think we can cut through here. Reason is right here. This guy. Hey, if you guys find any supplies or resources out there, uh, that might be useful. Don't hesitate to radio back here with the location. I can have our network of supply runners retrieve it. Seven total locations, or seven total uh, supply cache locations. I didn't pick anything up, did I? No, I didn't. The first one was like right where we just were. So instead of wasting our time having to do even more running around, figure we do that. Three of the guys are still with me. Sometimes they'll get carried away and left behind. I have a hotkey I can hit so that they just kind of regroup on me. But still got to be careful. Safe house. We've located some barrels of fuel. Roger that. I'll forward the location to the runners for pickup. Now, I'm pretty sure there isn't any on my way to the petrol plus. So I'm going anyways though. Where I'm trying to go is right here. We're gonna find a, uh, whatchamacallums. We're gonna find a uh, fast travel point along the way. fully been up this way yet. Time to explore. Not a whole lot of anything going on out here. There's a weird patch of like lag there too. Loot crate. Vest. I'm gonna check that vest out in a second. A side rail pistol light. Uh, I went to the wrong thing. Ooh. Definitely want that. What kind of vest he has? Light vest. I'll give him the medium vest then. The one I found was another or medium vest as well, but it was uh, a uncommon. Gave a little bit more uh, in terms of armor. And this game has that too, because obviously if it has RPG elements, it would have that. Has a rarity. Um word I'm looking for. Rarity uh, scale, for lack of a better word. This might take a while. So I don't really know if I want to fully get invested, but I'm going to try. Uh-huh. Yes, sir. Ready on your go. Now, this place is absolutely brutal. Like, you can get killed. Ready on your go. Like, no tomorrow here. And you're going to see me take a hell of a lot of damage. As it is. Got those two guys. See if I can push up without getting my ass creamed. This guy's all confused. Nice. There's certain angles you just don't want to fucking mess with. Roger. Let's get Ninja up that way. Zinc is basically here just for medical medical support. Get it. 
You might get shot at from there. I wonder if... Out of range. Nope, wrong person. Roger. Death. Yeah. That was a no-go. Retreating back for some reason, so... Got it. Take this opportunity to move up. You got it. Ready on your go. Death backed up a little bit. You know what's gonna happen is they're gonna try to flank me. You got it. Consider it done. Pull him back a little bit. Done. Definitely so, caught on to what I was doing. One down. Nice. Two down. This is actually going smoother than I've ever seen it go before. I don't know why. It's kind of scary, but it is. On it. I think he's just going to get pegged from there, but On we'll it. find out. Gun there to pick up. Wrong choice. Done. Uh huh. Let's see. I'm gonna get Ozzy to push up a bit, see what happens. He's got one. I wonder if suppression would help here. I think it would. Oops. Not you. Yes, you. sir. Good thing I caught that. I don't want that medic to push up now. Roger. Got it. Ready on your go. Just gotta be careful because there's another two guys out that way. Nice. Done. Let's go ahead and push up to here now. Ready on your Should goal. only be two more guys you back there. It. Consider it done. Got it. Yes, sir. So, I 
consider it done. Good work. Nice. That went extremely fucking smooth. <clears throat> Compared to what can happen there. Oh my god. And you should have seen it even before that. Oh my god. Looks like uh, Ninja and well, myself and Zinc leveled up. On it. Make sure everyone's loaded up. You got it. Got it. Roger. Cool. Let's go ahead and give out these skill points. Luck or knockback reduction. Ability cooldown too even. Let's go for luck. Combat medic. Increased chance of scoring critical hits. Go for that. Loot everything we can now. Mish 2000 equipment. Back. They'll have some kind of headgear, even though the cloth ones obviously don't protect from anything. Sight. Ammo, most important thing. Safe house, we've lo uh, located some crates of provisions. Roger that. I'll forward the location to the runners for pickup. Ammo. It's another provision there, too. Or supply, rather. Small med kit. Don't think there's anything back this way. You can use it to kind of flank around, but it doesn't really work, obviously, because there's... They can see through that, and there's a couple guys back there, so. Safe house, we've located some barrels of fuel. Roger that, I'll forward location runners for pickup. Looks like the other two guys leveled up finally. We'll go with luck. He does have a really good ability, so I'll get the ability cooldown. Another vest. It's the wrong thing. I'll get better at the menuing, I promise. It's a heavy vest anyways. Never mind. This is the reason we came here. We need that for the generators. Sop mod. There's another gun over there. Forever. Sop mod is just better overall. It only has one uh, thing I could add to. One uh, augment slot. up that guy's MK-46. Guess I'll go this way so I can get that scrap. There's also an ammo crate back here too. You can get those in the middle of the battle, by the way. I didn't think I would need it. I didn't. Ammo here. A lot of uh, enemies here. There should be a fast travel up by me or somewhere near me. There it is right there. Don't know if I've legitly discovered it yet. There we go. Couple crates here I can open too. We'll get the crates, we'll head back finish this mission that I'm on, and then uh, we'll call it a video. Kit. Grenade. Come along, guys. 
And also, I get the ability to heal up too, so hey. Why wouldn't I? Alright. Do I have anything to break down? Yeah, I do. We'll get rid of this. That's the same one. So we'll get rid of that. Equipment. 